boys and girls, welcome back. I'm Ms. Zelaya, thank you for joining me today. I wanna to show you something. Have you ever used one of these tools? That's right, this is called the ruler. What about one of these? Ever used one of these? This is called the measuring tape. So both these tools are actually used for measuring something. Do you know what it is? They're used for measuring length, and that's what we're gonna learn about today. So what is length? Length is actually something that is measured and you figure out how long is it. So think about that word, how long is it? When we learn about length, we're going to use some specific key phrases. The first phrase I want you to remember, is it longer than? The next one, we're going to look at shorter than. And the last phrase that we're going to use is, is it about the same length? So think about those things as we move forward with our lesson and our examples. Here we go. All right, guys, so the first example that I'm showing you here, it's two different cube trains. I'm looking at both of them for the length and I'm counting for the first one, I see one, two, three cubes. And for the bottom one, I see one, two, three, four, five. I know that the bottom one has two extra cubes, so that means that this is a longer length longer than the red one. So this yellow is longer than the red. Okay, so that's the first example. Now for my next example, I have two glue sticks. So here's the first and here's the other one. For both of them, they might look like the same stick, but they do have a different length. So I'm looking at this one. This one is actually shorter then this one I could see, and I could even use my cube train here just to kind of give me an idea of how long. Notice this one, um, the longer one ends somewhere around here. And the shorter one ends maybe about four units or so. So that means that this one is longer than this one. So that makes this one shorter, shorter than this one. So I want you to focus the small one has a length that is shorter than that one, okay? Let me give you another example. I want you to look at this one. Here's a baby little tarantula, and here's a baby little grasshopper. Let me get it a little closer. Maybe you could see it a little better. So there's my little tarantula, and here's my little grasshopper. So I want you to notice both of these, okay? Now, if I look at the length, I'm noticing they're both pretty similar in length. If I wanted to see, for example, if I counted my cube train, one, two, three, they kind of end somewhere similar in length. So I would say that both of these are about the same length, about the same length. Here's another example. Here's one paintbrush and here's another paintbrush. Both of the paintbrushes look similar, but they have different lengths. I'm looking for the shorter. The shorter one actually looks like it's this one. I notice the cube drain here, and I'm noticing that this one is much longer. So I'm, I'm noticing this one is shorter than, shorter than this one. Here's another example. I have one, two cars. Now notice my two cars. What would you guys think? about the length for both of these. Well, it looks like they are both about the same length. I'm just kind of looking at both of these um, little cars and I notice both of them kind of look about the same length to me, okay? And then for our last example here, I have two worms. I have one, let me get it a little closer. You guys can see the little, the little worm and then there's the other worm. Now both of these worms have a different length. Which one do you think has a shorter length? I'm looking at both of them and I'm looking at the units here to kind of help me get an idea of what would be the shorter length. So I notice the green one has a shorter than this, this red one. So this is the shorter than that worm, okay? Now we're going to move on to the next item. So are you guys ready? Now it's your turn. Now you get to decide. Is it going to be longer than, shorter than, or about the same? So let's go over the first one, ready? So look at this top carrot, okay? 
Look at the top one. Now, is the length shorter than the bottom one? Is it longer than the bottom one? Or is it about the same? Think about it. If you guys said that it's shorter than, then you are correct. Good job. Let's look at the next example. So I want you to look at this both of these caterpillars, but focus on the bottom one. Now look at the bottom one. Is that caterpillar longer than the top one? Is it shorter than the top one? Or is it about the same? Think about it for a moment. All right, if you said that it's a longer caterpillar, you are correct. Good job. Let's go to the next example. All right, now look at the pencils. I want you to look at both of them though. What do you think? Is the length, one of them, is one of them longer than the other? Is one of them shorter than the other? Or are both of them about the same length? What do you guys think? Good job, if you said that they're about the same length, you got it correct. Good job, let's go to the next one. Look at these candy bars, yummy, right? Okay, look at the top one. I want you to focus on that one. Is the length longer than? Is it shorter than? Or is it about the same as the bottom one? What do you guys think? Good job if you said that it is a longer, the top one is a longer length. Great job, guys. What about the next one? Let's see. So these are both shoes. I want you to look at both of them, okay? Is the length longer for either one of them? Is it shorter than for either one of them? Or are both of them about the same? What do you guys think? Good job, guys, if you said that they're about the same length. They are both about the same length. Thank you for joining me today. You guys did an amazing job. I'll see you in the next video. Take care.